Hello everybody and welcome, I'm Son of Mogef, it's 2 Video Tuesday and I am playing Colony Survival, picking up where we left off last week. What was I doing? I built these last week, I didn't do that one for some reason. I guess I just ran out of time? I'll probably, I probably just ran out of time, so I may expand it. Um, I'll make it bigger. Maybe I'll make that bigger like this during the night. God damn it. Let's see how we're doing here. I've got one of these down here, meaning, yep, I'm a little bit short on the old barley. I did add to the extra farms reasonably recently. Not entirely convinced that it's made a huge difference, although it does appear to be going upwards. I can check... Here, uh, where's the barley? Did I go past it? Nope, there it is. So, uh, oh wait, it moved. How dare you move? Yeah, it's kind of hard to see. It's like down there somewhere. You can change the the scale, but I I think I'll just. It's sometimes easier just to keep an eye on the numbers, really. Let's have a look. I am a little bit short on the old gunpowder, aren't I? I might have to up these amounts a little bit. Just so the zombies don't become a problem. The charcoal is not doing well. Okay, that's something that I can sort out pretty much immediately. So let's go and do that. Ah, ah there they are. <laughs> They're over there. So, I just believe a couple more of these guys will do it. Yeah, it's just made from firewood. I believe I've got plenty of firewood, do I not? Not a huge amount, actually. Let me just throw some of that in there. The the wood is alright-ish. I just need a couple more of these uh, kilns. Oh, I, I've got another two there. Now let me think, if I move these guys, if uh, if I put two kilns here, I guess I can move these guys to over here? Not really sure where else I would put them. I guess I'll do that. Let me just set up another area here. I need them and one of these and one of them. Oh yeah, also last week I built a new area up there, up up there, for like uh, herbs and flax and stuff like that, and I never actually did the research. <laughs> so let's get that started. What else do I have here? Uh, water pumps, kind of useless at this point. I've got real easy access to water. That's m masonry workbench thing. This is going to take a long time. So yeah, let's just do this. If I do that, and I can do... That's where the job block will go. So I can put that there. It's kind of dark down here, isn't it? <laughs> I put that bed there, and this bed there, and this bed there. Okay. Like, I don't need all of these uh, beds and places right now, but I feel like it's a good idea just to set them up early. So let's, uh... Oh, no, that's that's the wrong job block. There's that one and that one. I can put those there and there, and then I can put these two here. Boom. Boom, and then recruitment, fill all jobs. Okay, now... Oh, yeah, the barley's recovered quite nicely. What else is there to do? Luxury mills seem to be down, but then there was the barley issue, wasn't there? So that should catch up. I might need a few more cooks, actually. These guys are working away, but I also feel like 
there's enough in the way of colonists now that I might need to get another bunch of them. For some bizarre reason, got six stoves. I'm not sure how that happened. Oh, is that honey? Might have to sort that out as well. I've got raw beeswax and regular beeswax. Apparently the herb farming is complete, so that's, uh, that's something that got done very, 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 very quickly. I guess I'll go for the stonemasons next, just so I can fill this stuff up. It's going rapidly. I still haven't decided what I'm doing with the cooks, though. I've definitely got the capacity for it. I think I'll just go for it. Which means I'll need another one of these, another one of them, and one of them, and... Uh, four of those. I couldn't put it down for a second there. If I do that, and then I can do that. Then I've got to put these down. Uh, there? Yeah, that looks like it might be right. There, let's uh, put the stoves down. Like so, and I'll pop one there. Get those hired. Right, I've, I've got honey issues apparently. That's interesting. I guess I am cooking a lot of food now. Where are my beekeepers? There they are. Oh! Oh, I did it like... Oh, I did it like this, didn't I? Like I do my berry farms. So they're still 5x5. Five five. I've just cut out the extra beehive. So I could technically just put another four down, couldn't I? Hmm. Yeah, I, th I think I'll go ahead and do that. Uh, food... Where, where's the beekeepers? Oh, there they are. <laughs> the cursor on it. Oh, no, it's not a 5x5. Five five, it's 3x3, three three, isn't it? I'm dumb. Oh, and everybody's going to bed. Well done, me. Okay, well, I'll get this done. Maybe I'll make a start on the platform that goes here just to keep things somewhat symmetrical, and I'll bring you guys back in the morning. Okay, it's just about morning. I haven't quite finished building this yet, although there's the frame done. That's pretty awesome. The stonemasons is uh, ready, so that's also cool. I uh, did add an extra couple of, oh, well, four, in fact, plots for the beekeepers. Oh, I forgot to hire them. That was a bit of a dumb dumb, wasn't it? There we go. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do that. I've got colony points to spend again. Let's have a look. Uh, let's get the efficiency. I do kind of need the colonist capacity, but you can see it's a very small amount compared to the amount that I can have. So that will build up very, very quickly. Hopefully. Hopefully quickly. I do want to do a quick run around here, just round the outside to uh, make sure there aren't any zombies on the inner part of the loop. I don't think there will be now that I've got guards to take them out automatically, but it is something I'm still quite paranoid about. <laughs> just a quick check. Yeah, it seems alright to me. The red-skinned zombie over there. If things get too hectic, I can always add some more guards up here. Like on these corners, it's, again, not really an issue. Okay. And I've got some more space over here that I've not been using. That's nice to know. If I ever need more berries, which, which I apparently don't, I've got all the berries in the world. Should I need them, though, I can extend the berry farms down there, or I can add extra, like, uh, foresters over there, I guess. That wouldn't hurt either. I need to keep my eye on this, make sure it's going in the right direction. Just let's 
do some uh, copper tools and parts maintenance here. Just have a check. Okay, the charcoal and the cokes are better. Coal ore is all right. Got plenty of tin. Very little silver, but I'm all right with that. Copper's all right. The iron ore we had an issue with before, but I think that's recovering. Okay, good. Gunpowder is a little on the low side. Maybe I'll go bump that up just a smidge. Huh. Where are my uh, gunsmiths, do you think? Over there, maybe? Yeah, there we go. Let's just maybe bump this a little bit. Doesn't need to be all that much. Needs gunpowder and three linen pouches. Interesting, but it makes three gunpowder pouches, so maybe I'll just put this up to 75 so it's like a one to one ratio. I, I, I mean, that'll do for now, right? <laughs> the ammo's looking good, the gunpowder pouches are looking good. These guys don't have what I believe is gold ingots. I think these guys are the... Oh, these guys can't make gold ingots because they've got no gold ore. I don't think that's really a huge priority, to be honest. I do have science, though. Complete. Uh, I guess I'll do wax tablets. I just brought a bunch more beekeepers into the colony, so... If they can't keep up with that, I've got space to add more. Let's go ahead and get that done. It is uh, more colony points for us. Is a good th Water? They don't have water. Ah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's actually surprising to me. Where are my water gatherers? Are they in a dark corner somewhere? Nope, they're over here. All right. What am I doing for fish as well? Tons of fish, no lobster, as is tradition. I think I'll add two more water gatherers. I nearly said water farmers and caught myself out before I said the dumb thing. But then I told you that I did it, so, you know, that doesn't really negate the dumb, does it? There we go. Boop, 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 boop. Let's uh, hire these guys. Ooh, it looks kind of funky down here when you have the when you have the marker up for the safe zone. Interesting. It's very orange and then it goes very like lime. Not quite fully green, but it's trying. <laughs> Stupid thing to say. Got no bread. Got no water and no bread. What what did I, what did I do here? It's made in the workbench. I didn't realise people on the workbench could make bread. I've been playing all this time, literally, like, bordering on 400 hours, I think. And I never noticed that people on the workbenches can make bread. Where are my guys on the workbenches, by the way? <laughs> I constantly get lost in my own colony. Uh, workbenches? Hello? They're in here somewhere, I know they are. Oh, hang on. Yeah, there's two guys here. Yeah, look at that. They can make bread. Oh, it needs a bread crate. Huh. The storage or gifting crate is not used by colonists. So, for these guys to make bread, you need a bread crate. But the bread that goes in the bread crate doesn't get used by the colonists. Alright. Again, I, I guess that's a multiplayer feature, so I'm going to need more guys on the ovens, right? We've got plenty of flour and plenty of wheat. Just let's get some guys on oven duty. This is the cooking section. I might have to colour some of these um, panels, like if I colour the floor from here to here, I can have like the food area 
And then from like there to, I don't know, up there will be the tailoring area. Also, these guys don't have herbs because I didn't plant them because I'm dumb. Let's go ahead and... Uh... Oh. Oh, these, these guys are going to bed already. Oh, no. Oh, damn. Oh well, uh, I guess I'll go finish building that other farm and do some zombie murder and then I'll bring you guys back in the morning for day three. There we go. Once again, it is morning. I finished building the thing, although I forgot to add the beds and stuff. God damn it. Let's go ahead and do that now. Because, you know, once again, I'll only forget if I don't do it, so... And it does give us a bunch of spare beds, should my guys just decide to, you know, go sleep in a random bed. Which they do on a regular basis. I can't remember if I was putting these beds round that way or the other way. It doesn't matter all that much. So, I finished the herbs uh, research, didn't I? Didn't didn't put any of the new herbs down and then I finished the masonry research didn't put the mason down so there's that <laughs> that I need to do as well now this is also nearly complete I am the happy with this plenty of cabbages still lots of eggs and chicken meat and olives and the barley is going up yeah, it looks all right to me. Oh, the flax is not doing well. That's fine. I've just built an extension. Hey. Wait. Hang on. Hang on. Where is it? I lost it for a moment there and I was confused. So I can put two more flax. Uh, what did that, that... There was a message that popped up about food. And I, uh, I didn't... I didn't read it. Let's go ahead and put another farm there and there. Like so. I can hire these two guys right now. And then up here, I can have two farms of the one I always forget, the yellow one. And just one each of the others. Because the... Is it Wolfsbane? I believe it's Wolfsbane. You need more of... Because you make, like, linen. linen. That's that's Alcanet. I better make sure, hadn't I? I? I don't know why I always forget this. Yeah, I'll go check just to be sure. I can never remember which one it is. And when I guess, I'm often wrong. Oh, uh, linen shirt is yeah. It it's oops, is linen which is made from flax and wolfsbane. So I just want to have a little bit more wolfsbane than the other ones. Uh, no, this is wrong. It, this is also wrong. There we go. Flax and herbs, wolfsbane. There we go. So if I have two of those. Like so. I just noticed there's a nice platform of tree here <laughs> that I hadn't noticed before. That's kind of fun. And then I want some of this here, and I want some of that. I can never remember what all four of these these herbs are. Recruitment. Fill or do oh, I don't have the colony points, although the, I meant the colony capacity, although I, I have got the points. Let's just do a bunch of upgrades here. So I've got 125 of the possible 175, which is much better. Awesome. Let's have another looky here to see how they're doing. The bread is still not good, and the barley's gone down. Although I've got more cooks now, haven't I? I'm tempted just to fill up that top level over there with barley and have a surplus. I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. It does mean more people, but... 
Ah! I nearly, I nearly fell down the hole. It's really bright here! Oh, I have my torch on, which probably contributed to that. Is this the Barley Farms? It is, yeah. Just thought I'd better make sure. You know what I'm like. That That's wrong. Again. Food. Barley. There we go. I mean, I built these platforms for a reason. I shouldn't be struggling through a lack of resources when I have them available. I built them. Yay, my science is ready. We've done a lot of science today. That's a good thing. I didn't do my daily... Uh, Patrol, now that I'm thinking about it. Let's just look. Oh yeah, there's one there's one guy over there. I could make a little bridge here to go across so I don't have to keep dropping down. I might have to go ahead and do that, like frame it up. Uh there you go, didn't break my leg. Go me. Do 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 no, we look clear, which is awesome. What else do I need to do? I don't have a masonry guy, so let's go ahead and find a place for him. I have no idea where he's going to go. Not a clue in the slightest. Let's complete that science. But what else are we going to do here? I could get the doll. Oh, let's get some lanterns. I like the lanterns in this game. Right, stone mate. Oh my god! Look, they're all up. They all there. They're. All, I can't speak today. Been flobbing my words all damn day. Yeah, these guys all want lobster and they have none. I guess I could put the masonry, the ma masonry, the mason, the stone mason right there. Recruitment. <laughs> Little jobs. I normally don't bother that much with them. They don't really make anything that I'm entirely interested in. I did use them in a previous playthrough to make a bunch of, like, blocks that I made the new colony out of, but I'm not really doing that anymore. How are these guys doing? They've got no bloody beeswax? Why? Why they have no beeswax? Well, they are going into candles quite a lot, and the honey is recovering. I just want to give it a little bit of time. There's no flax. I've just added flax farms. I need to chill. That will balance itself out over time. Oh my good god, they're all going to bed already. I feel like I've only just come back from that. Never mind, let me go... Get up on the podium here and overlook my minions. Because that's how I choose to describe them. Uh, like that. There we go. So, yeah, that's this week's episode of Colony Survival. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Put your comments down in the comments section. I'm sure there's something I forgot in this video. And it's probably something that I regularly forget. So, uh, if you know what that is... Put that down in the comments section. Also, like and subscribe if you're new or you're not new and you haven't done that yet, which makes you one of the naughty people. Naughty, naughty. I said that in the Morning Thrive video. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Uh, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow for... What am I... I keep forgetting what I play on Wednesdays. Outer Wilds, that's what it is. The game that I keep wanting to call New Wilds for whatever reason. So, yeah, come back tomorrow for that, and I'll see you then. I'll shut up in the meantime. It's probably better that I do that. <laughs>